Okay, and then of course you have another small, teeny weeny, tiny film coming out. Uh, Breaking Dawn Part 2. Oh boy. So you have a role in. Yeah. You went down to Comic Con. I sure did. And uh, it was revealed who you were, and you, apparently you were very popular at Comic Con. Fans went a little nuts though for you. Yeah, yeah. It was it was a gr it was a great experience. Um, they're 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 real intense. Yeah. Yeah. They want to know everything about every person that's in that film. They really do. They really How do. many days did you film on this on the set there? Um, I think it was about like three weeks in between Baton Rouge and, and uh, Vancouver. Mm -hmm. So it's a fairly significant role if you were filming for three weeks then. Yeah, but you know the process for film too is it's, um, it's really long. Yeah. You know, so it can take like a few days to set up a shot. Right, just to shoot one scene right. as opposed right. to Revolution where you guys are probably going right. a lot quicker. Yeah, and then plus there's a lot of, you know, makeup and yes. wardrobe and... Um, that whole process of getting it, you know, everyone has to agree on it, so it's it's yeah. big. It, it was a big experience. I loved it. Absolutely loved it. So tell me about this character that you play in it. I play Noel, who's half human, half vampire, mm -hmm. and um, and he's the legend, so to speak, uh, hybrid, and that's really all I can say about <laughs> it. So there's not many of the half human, half vampire not many. hybrids. Of course, not there's now Renesme. Right. But so your character actually is uh, in the book. You go to the Volturi to tell them that this was a. Come on, come on. See, this is something. great. No, you can say it. I oh, can't. Come you can on. Say it. I'll just nod. <laughs> come on. Do they have to like make? Do you make? Do they make you sign your life away? That you can't. Uh, say you don't have to sign word? your life away, but you 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 do sign an agreement. To, you do. Yeah, but you know what? It's it's um. It's strange. As much as I would love to to talk about my whole experience yeah. on it, it's kind of cool because you don't want to ruin it for the right. fans. Yeah. And that's that. It really is a big deal. I mean, there, there's like waited long for this, and, and it's really important. So. So you don't want to. I have to respect Say that. too much and then get in trouble, yeah. and then everyone will be mad at you. Yeah. And wait right. till <laughs> wait till the film comes out, then I'll write my own book about my experience. Ah, about. there you go. Well, no, were they welcoming to you? <laughs> There's a lot they of were, new people in that. In yeah, the, they were. They one. they um, they're really a family. Yeah. You know, and and uh, jumping into it, it was it was uh, it was a little nerve wracking because they they have shot those films together and and they've grown together and you know here I am and I come in and it's it's um, you don't want to mess it up mm -hmm. uh, their work or anything so yeah. but they were very gracious, very kind. It was. It was great. How'd you get that role? I mean, it must have been so many people that auditioned um, for that part. The casting director, Deborah Zane, called me in. She had cast me in um, The Burning Plane. Mm -hmm. And so she called me up and asked if I would come in to audition for Twilight. And I said, you know, of course. Yeah. Oh, hello. Uh, but it was great because <laughs> you only had, like, uh, like one page. They, they, they keep everything close to the vest, too.